Joe, tell us who you are. Joe. I'm Joe Jomi. With uh, with Ace Hardware in Harrington. How long have you been running this? Uh, this uh, I'm on 42 and a half years. 42 right now. and a half years. That's amazing. So, a lifelong resident of uh, Mason Valley, Harrington. No. no. Lifelong resident of Lyon County. Lyon County. Okay. Grew up in Smith Valley. Yep. Yeah. So uh, you know. How would you characterize the, the state of the economy in Yarrington right now or over the last few years? Simply, it sucks. Oh, okay. <laughs> yeah, that's pretty blunt. It's, well, what else are you going to say? Yeah. It, with the economy the way it's down, if we don't get some type of business in here, there's going to be more businesses closed. If you go downtown, you can see all the businesses that are closed. Yeah. And they're still closing? They're still closing. Right. So would you would you say there's an urgency in terms of getting something uh, going here? Urgency is a mild word. Yeah. It could be worse than that. Yeah. It could be a lot. Yep. Coarser. Yep. The need to be done is now. Not six months from now, but now. Right. So you've been in business for 42 and a half years here. We started in 1970. 1970? 72. Yes. I mean, lately, of course, uh, there's been three companies working in town, Nevada Copper, Entre, and have you seen a little bit of an uptick in business? I've seen the mining companies, yeah, they've, right. they've helped. But when you're uh, sitting there trying to get stuff through Congress, and they just waylay you, nothing yeah. you can do about it. Yeah. You just sit back and hope. Yeah. Now, you're active in other... Uh, no, a few a, things. A few things in town. So... Uh, I mean, considering the economic conditions, what 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 would you characterize the spirit of the the city? You think the would the on the economy? I think most of us are scared to death. Yeah. Whether it's going to pick back up, if it's going to fall further down. I've been through the good times. I've been through. I'm going through the bad times. Right. When was the last time you had good times? E early two thousand late nineties. Yeah. And then after that, it it's just gone downhill. Since. Right. Right. And not really come back. It come back a little bit last year, right. but not much. Right. In, in that time period, there were there was building going on too. Wasn't there was there? a lot of building going on, and that was stuff farmers. that was a good market for you. That was a good market for everybody. Right. So if if houses started being built again, that would probably if be the a, houses started being built, yes. But there's so many rentals right now, houses on the market. <coughs> you may not have to build houses for a while. Right. You might be able to get some of the older houses that people want to rebuild. Right. And get them back. And get them rebuilt. Where would you see your business going? You know, let's say we get the mine going and things start ramping up. Is is do you see your business just recovering or expanding? I or? think it can recover. First, you got to recover before right. you can expand. From ten years ago, I'm down four employees. Okay, so that should tell you something. And then, right. And how many people were you employing that that at time? one time? I had about eight. Eight people working here between full time and part time. Yeah. And your daughter works here with you, right? One daughter, the other daughter's coming home. Is, is there, uh, would there be an interest by them to continue the business? In the the oldest daughter, yes. No, so they would be interested in, and that would be... Well, they're going to keep it going. Right. Between the two of them. Yeah. So, uh, any other thoughts or comments you'd say, uh, if you wanted to send a message to, to Washington? I don't think they'd like my thoughts. <laughs> they would like your thoughts. Because I think they're sitting back and... Playing with everyone's lives and not realizing they're playing with their lives. Mm -hmm. They're doing what they want to do and not what the people want to do. Oh, okay. Well, that's a good good characterization. So, uh, good. Well, thanks for talking to us today. Appreciate it. Oh, you're welcome.